To another Saturday of the Parents Connect Helpline show to fight her cancer and members, like even including herself. If you put everything, children who end up not even knowing who we are. Um, that phrase, for the sake of peace, you constantly need to go and appease the person. Mm -hmm. Because what you will have done is, first of all, you have not given the person an opportunity to figure out that what they are doing is actually wrong. Mm -hmm. And the fact that you keep apologizing, it's a form of negative reinforcement. Mm. Where for every single time something goes wrong, you need to be the one to go back and apologize. Mm. And after a while, they become comfortable mm. in bad behavior. Mm. So what you actually do is you get to a point where you must open up a conversation around it. Okay. And in opening up a conversation around it, and th th there's something Mrs. Chika said that's very um, true. You see, it's one thing to have a conversation with a partner on something that bothers you, but the way you approach it is key. Mm -hmm. To everybody listening, there's something called an I statement. Okay. An I statement is a statement that's devoid of blame, devoid of criticism. And it goes something like, my dear, I feel that for every time we have an, an argument, you expect me to X, Y, Z. Mm -hmm. And it makes me feel ABC. You see, an I statement allows you to say the toughest things without sounding like you're criticizing or you're blaming. Okay. That is one powerful, uh, powerful tool okay. when it comes to communication. Okay. So using an I statement, you can engage mm -hmm. with your wife okay. so that she does not see it as criticism or you blaming, but you're simply saying it. An I statement means that this is how I feel. You're allowed to tell me how you feel about it. Okay. So we are conversing. We're not arguing. We're not bickering. Okay. Yes.